What's going on, America? It's your boy Charlie in the Box, the Patriot of Misprint. But I'm gonna have my box today. It's gonna be. It looks like Happy Fourth of July, America. Let's get this video started. This is gonna be a little bit of Patrick Henry's Give Me Liberty or Give Me Death, sprinkled with a little bit of Charlie in the Box. Enjoy. They tell us, sir, that we are weak, unable to cope with such formidable and adversary. But I would soon ask, when shall we be stronger? Is it next week? How about even next year? Or is it gonna be when we're totally disarmed and we have a federal guard stationed at each and every one of our households? Shall we acquire the means of an effectual resistance so laying so hopelessly on our backs and hugging the phantom delusion of hope until our government has went into our homes and get us handcuffed? and taking us off to a FEMA camp. Sir, we are not weak if we use the means which the God of nature has placed in our power. Millions of people armed in the holy cause of liberty in such a country as that we possess or are invincible by any means. With tyranny, our government can try to oppress. Besides, sir, we should not fight this battle alone. There is a just God that presides over the destiny of nations who rise up our friends to fight this battle with us. The battle is not for the strong alone. It's for the active and the vigilant and the brave and every freedom loving American wishes to stand today. Sir, there is no election. If we were based enough to deserve it, it is now too late to retire from the contest. There is no retreat but in submission and slavery. Our chains were forged. Their clanking will be heard on the streets of Boston. The war is inevitable. Let it come. I repeat, sir, let it come. It is in vain to extenuate the matter. Gentlemen may cry, peace, peace. But there shall be no peace. The next gale that sweeps in the north will bring to our ears the clash of resounding arms. Our brothers in the fields are already fighting. Why do we stand here idle? What shall gentlemen wish and what shall they have is life so dear and peace so sweet to be purchased by the price of chains and slavery? Forbid it, almighty God. I know not what course others may take, but as for me, give me liberty or give me death. 